best with hospital employees taking a last stand tonight. Yes, dozens of Houston Methodist employees are rallying in mm -hmm. Baytown tonight. They're angry over the hospital system's requirement that all employees either get the coronavirus vaccine or lose their jobs. Our Roseanne Aragon was live on the KPRC2 Facebook page tonight, streaming tonight's demonstration on the heels of the hospital network's vaccination deadline. She joins us live now in Baytown with more. Roseanne? Tonight is the deadline for Houston Methodist employees to get vaccinated. For several hours, employees and supporters filled this street to voice concern. Meanwhile, the hospital is defending its decision to mandate the jab. Here outside Houston Methodist Baytown Hospital Monday. I'm losing my job. I think that I'm being wrongfully terminated. Crowds of Houston Methodist employees and supporters. <laughs> voicing their support. I took my mask off, threw my shirt on, walked out the door, and here I am. Organizer and nurse Jennifer Bridges has become the face of a lawsuit filed by more than 100 nurses, physicians, and workers across Houston Methodist, refusing to get the COVID-19 vaccine, saying the vaccine is experimental and only approved for emergency use authorization. They're not doing the right thing. They need to give people choices. For ER nurse Amanda Rivera. I feel like they kind of bullied us into this little corner, like, you have to do it or else you don't have a job. She's torn. Suspension starts tomorrow. It'll be two weeks, no pay. And then if you don't comply within our two weeks, then you go to termination. Houston Methodist stated, we are proud to report that almost 100% of our 26,000 employees have complied, making the right decision to fulfill their sacred obligation to protect our patients. Unfortunately, a few employees have not met the vaccine requirements and are inviting other employees to join them as they end their shifts today. Legal analyst Sophia George says Houston Methodist is within its legal right. They may not want to take the vaccine. However, the EEOC has come out with guidance very recently saying that what Methodist is doing is entirely legal. Organizers tell us this case will face a federal judge later this week. Houston Methodist confirmed to KPRC that not a single person actually walked off their job while they were on their shift tonight. Reporting live from Baytown, Roseanne Aragon, KPRC 2 News.